Hey guys, it's Shifty here with my second um, second game. Uh, I wanted to mix up the map a little bit. I don't want to be continuously playing uh, Fighting a Spirit just because it's map of the week. And I, I really like the map, but mix it up a little bit with Destination now. Um, yeah, and the matchup is uh, Protoss versus Terran. Uh, I'm playing Protoss, and we're both D ranked on 1096, I think. 1093 or something, not very high. I just won, I'm one for one right now after my first loss, which I didn't even bother to broadcast, which, I mean, I said I would, but I'm sorry, guys, that was just humiliating, and I just, first game on my laptop, not used to it at all. So, yeah, uh, but, I, I mean, I expect I will be losing sometime soon, occasionally, uh, you never know if somebody might cheese or something like that, uh, I don't know, I, but I will be sure to post it up. Um, and, yeah, uh <laughs> Terrible pylon placement. Look at that. It's just, uh, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm kind of just trying to be as fast as I can, but my mouse is kind of just spazzing about. Uh, anyways, yeah, I was thinking whether I should have done a cheese, but then I realized that cheeses don't really work too well on this map against Terran just because Terrans, they can do that um, racks with uh, two depot block. Which is real. I mean, Z Lines can't run past it, and the way I tried to get around it before was. Um, to put a pylon where the supply depot would be, but then even then they just put another supply depot behind that pylon and they can still make a successful block if they lift the racks in time, which, I mean, is really frustrating because you're wasting so many resources on pylons, z lines, and while the guy is, uh, his economy isn't even da uh, damaged, but... Yeah, so that's why I'm not gonna go for any kind of cheese or anything like that. And I'm doing, I'm, I'm also kind of doing a late scout here. I'm uh, scouting after I get my simulator, which uh, I usually do after I get my gateway, uh, just because I think it's standard. I should be able to get it in time before he builds up his second depot if he really, uh, if he doesn't, like, if he doesn't build the depot and then can't, uh, and then leave the SCV to finish the rash or something like that. But I'm, oh, I'm losing my uh, eight minerals right there. Another. Just faulty misclick. Yeah, <laughs> not, not fantastic here, guys. Um, so yeah, uh, and but I don't think a late scout really matter here because um, I feel uh, it's pretty standard build. Uh, I know where the Terran is, so I don't have to spend time scouting early to know what kind of build he's going for. And unless he's going for a cheese or something, I think he'll be okay. I'm not really bothered by it. And um, yeah, I don't know if you guys noticed, but he just I noticed he finished his. Uh, refinery, but he's taking a while to get the SCVs there, and it doesn't even look like he has three SCVs uh, mining gas. So I'm, it's pretty clear that he's going to be going for a um, not a very uh, offensive build. So I think I'll be going for one gate expansion. Uh, yeah, <clears throat> but yeah. So um, just trying to keep my probe alive over here. Um, it doesn't really matter. I think I feel. Uh, I already know what he's gonna go for, so I'll be okay if I sacrifice. And now I see three SEVs, but I don't think maybe it was just his blunder. Maybe it was. I don't think it, maybe he wasn't planning anything strategic. And he actually does have three SEVs after he built the uh, after he started building the factory. So this is kind of weird. Um, uh, maybe this is just maybe this is just D level mistakes over here, like uh, my misclicks and bad splits and stuff like that. I don't know. But um, I, I also, if you guys notice sometimes, um, if I select the probe map to build something, it pops up to the advanced tech screen, that's because I press V instead of B, just because the buttons are so close to each other and they're not popped out that I, uh, half the time I just press V, and then it's really annoying if I want to build pylons, like, quickly build pylons or something, it just, it, I have to press cancel, which is also hard to find on here because it doesn't pop, none of the keys pop out, so it's really annoying on the laptop, but, uh, getting better at it, so yeah. The SCV has 10 HP, but I'm, I, I thought a Dragoon would be able to run faster than the SCV, but I guess not. He he runs, you know, he outran me, so I don't really know what's going on here. I haven't played this game in a while. I've been playing SC2 beta mostly, and um, yeah, fantastic game. I can't wait for it to come out. I'll definitely be uh, playing um, and uh, capping my own games. Uh, I was in the Diamond League. I don't understand the divisions. I was in Dropship November. I have no idea what that means. I was ranked fourth. I, I don't know. I wish Blizzard would explain it, but um, I'm sure uh, somebody will figure it out eventually. So yeah, now I'm just I put on my expansion, and I think uh, you know I got my dragoons out in the front. So I don't think he's gonna be. If he does do any kind of push, I'll be able to do a little harass. Uh, range dragoon range is almost done. Oh, it just finished. So I'll be able to uh, hit and run if he does decide to do any harass, but I don't think he will, I think I'll manage. Um, in fact, I might even move in with my Dragoons just to see uh, what he's doing, because 
If he was going to do an early push, he would have already done it. So at this point, I'm thinking Siege Tech with uh, Command Center. But uh, let's find out. I'm going to send um, my two units uh, there. And um, let's, let's see what he has. Uh, he's okay. He has one marine, so barely built anything. Uh, he's got spider mine tech research. Oh, might as well destroy the mines. He's not doing much. Make him think that I'm DT rushing, maybe? No. If he's smart, he'd realize I have goon range, but he's not doing anything. Okay. So lose the SC or lose the vulture there. Um, this is kind of easy to harass, but I, on the one hand, I do have to say that I. Uh, this is a post-game commentary, I'm not doing in-game commentary, but I'm going to cast it like an in-game commentary, because I did actually just play it, well, I didn't just play it, I played it a while ago, and um, now I'm casting it, because it took me so long to figure out what programs to use and stuff, so it'll be like I'm casting a new game or something like that, but yeah, um, so I see that he, uh, but yeah, I, I was going to say that I forgot to manage my base. I totally just forgot building units. I didn't even hockey my second gateway, third gateway, or my uh, robotics. Didn't build my um, observatory in time or anything like that. But uh, trying to pick it up now, pick it up now. Um, going into four gateway. Uh, I don't think he has much. I didn't even see him floating a command center. I'm, I hope, well actually I do hope that he did it, but I hope he didn't. Uh, just because I, I hope he's at least decent. I hope he um, built command center and was floating it instead of just that he was planning to build it at the natural at the time because that's going to be really behind. Uh, he's going to be really behind economically. And um, I still have my two dragoons. Uh, he's not doing too much. Um, I'm not going to beat. Oh, another misclick. This is annoying. Just wanted to get some gas and then just click everything. Ugh. Hopefully this will disappear by the time I get to C, the C level or B level. Um, if I even if, if I even have time to get up there, uh, but yeah. Ooh, destroy the polar bear. Polar, some kind of bear. Uh, curse. I remember somebody used people used to say, "Oh, you destroy it's a curse." In uh, what was it, pro league or something like that? I don't remember. But um, yeah. I think that'll be safe to expand. Um, I'm gonna start expanding some more because I don't see him doing anything, and I'm just gonna forget my tech right now. I think I just pump out Master Goons. Uh, if he were to move out, he would be able to do it successfully with Terran because the tank push, uh, he could put it on the cliff. Um, I think, oh, uh, not the like too many probes on those gas. He could put tanks on the cliff and then keep, uh, with a tank push, he could move out and then establish his, uh, uh, his, what is that, 5 o'clock expansion. But, um, yeah, I have enough, I mean, I have a fair amount of Dragoons at the front. I could do some uh, harass while he's trying to move out, uh, and hopefully just delay what he's trying to do. But I have no idea. I don't even have an Observer. That was kind of a mistake. I just sacrificed my Observer there. Didn't even accomplish anything. Saw that he had some mines, like two tanks, which is totally useless. But now I'm building, a, uh, Zealots, sorry. Building some Zealots, and with Zealots, I should be able to, uh, if he does a tank push, I should be able to run by, given that, because he won't have time, much time to plant mines, so I'll be able to have the SCVs just hit the tanks, hopefully. But, um, yeah. So, uh, I don't think he's, I, don't, no, I have no idea what he's doing. He's sending out, he's not, well, he's sending out an SCV, but he's not doing anything that's, like, uh, that's uh, offensive or anything. And I'm just gonna take out this tank right here. It's, uh, might lose one Dragoon, maybe two. Um, one Dragoon, and yeah, for like, for no trade-off, he's not doing anything. 